What up everybody, it's your boy Fairly Ghost. This is a look into the new event here, where I'm at it. Just started it last night. Um, as you can see, this is the new event. I'm up on to page two. These are pretty similar to the last year's events, missions. You start off by exploring Hexylvania. It wants you to go to certain locations on the map where you will mark it. You get to go through and just explore it. After that, you know, mission's over. You go into the second one, test the storm traps. Basically, you start off by looking around. You find the traps. Uh, you place them down. Um, it's kind of similar to the mission a long time ago. You have to protect the lab there's four like generator type things you have to protect realistically only one of them has to survive so I'm not sure if that's pretty much the same thing here I didn't let any of them take damage so I'm pretty confident though that all you really do is have to let one of these survive to beat it and then you'll move on to the next one now most of these missions headed forward is going to be about finding things and searching things. Um, this one you have to find 15 gramophones. Um, as you can see when you first start these two, there's only one thing on the map that you can actually start. And after that, your map should look like this with an option of different missions you can do for different types of rewards. It looks like it's going to be like a neutral difficulty, probably depending on your level. Um, we were just doing a category one, fight the storm. Um, it looks like it's not available right now. But these will change in two hours. So, my opinion, cat ones are the easiest to do. So you can run around. There's not a timer. You can search because eventually you're going to have to start looking for these quests here. Um, one of the difficult one is probably going to be the castle hunter. You got to find all those castles. Every map is going to have a different castle set up. So trying to find the morning star castle could probably be, you know, you could probably go through 10 missions and not see it. But as far as the other stuff goes, you gotta find these catacombs. These are usually like in the ground, uh, like a cave type thing. And then you gotta do all these pumpkin head killer things, but these are just side quests that give you, you know, that gives you 250 candy if you complete it. So pretty much getting these completed is how to get a good chunk of candy, which candy is obviously used for these new pinatas. Let's open up a couple and check them out. We'll open up three of them. Careful with that axe! Oh, oh you! Now there's a list of weapons in the collection book if you're curious of what weapons are new that are going to be coming out of these llamas. You will be getting some survivors that are rare out of these llamas, which is pretty cool. Let's speed up a little bit here. Oh. What did I get? So these are the new weapons here. Oh, I guess I'll start off with the sniper. You never know. It's the bottom of the ninth. It's important to collect and save all the husks that are the survivors because there is a reward in the collection book if you haven't completed it yet to have the option to Shut unlock the, the jack o launcher. So remember that. You don't want to destroy them before you check to make sure that they're in the collection book. If that's what you do with your survivors, that's what I do at least, but some people hoard them.
That's a weird looking weapon. Oop, oop. I always need legendary survivors. Alright, well, those are some llamas that you can open. They got some pretty cool rewards in them, like I said. These are the heroes that can come out of them, which I already have most of them, but it would be nice to complete my collection, which I do have the other ones. These are just duplicates of all the people that I've had. So, and then this is the survivors, um, you know, collection, which I already have it completed. As you can see, that bottom one, oops, reward right there in the top right corner of that is the jack o launcher so those are the three main ones you're looking for to get out of a collection book if you haven't got it oh and these are the weapons <clears throat> so these are the new weapons the new guns pretty cool the halloween events usually my favorite one so far this hasn't let me down so hopefully this year it's the same there's going to be a huge different change in Fortnite coming up. Um, I'll share that with you and go over some of the things they're going to be changing Fortnite going into the future. You know, you can. I'll try to post some stuff to help you guys out during your quest line here in the Fortnite Mares. <laughs> 